everybody and welcome to World Environment Day 2014. Now before I get started I know what you're all going to say. So this is another initiative, busy, I ain't got time to do it and all the things that we talk about for all the other initiatives that we put to you. Um, but this guy at this time, I think you can really make a difference. And we can really make a difference to the world in which we live and the world around us. So just give us two minutes of your time, put your phones down, stop snapchatting, Sky Sports News or whatever else you're playing with. Give that bloke a nudge inside you and just listen to us for two minutes. So what's World Environment Day all about? Well, World Environment Day is the coming together of people from all over the world to work together towards a common theme. The common theme is protecting the planet in which we all live in. World Environment Day is an annual campaign by UNEP. It has a different theme each year and has tackled issues such as forests, resource depletion, biodiversity, food wastage and the green economy. 2014's theme is small islands and it's designed to tackle the impact that us as humans are having raising the temperature of the earth and raising the sea level. This is potentially causing low lying lands and islands to disappear. Now I know what you're thinking, where's the celebrated Dorseman? And you'd be right in asking. Well there's this guy, but remember don't mention his birthday. There's also a chap called Don Cheeto. Now I didn't know who he was either, but apparently he's a good guy in Iron Man and also been in Ocean's Eleven and things like that. We at BAM want you to pledge on one of these, like this. To do something differently on the 5th of June. Make it something simple, make it something that's easily achievable and make it something that you can carry on long after World Environment Day. Some of the ideas that you might want to do include... Start with turning off these. Make sure you turn off these. You can definitely turn these down. You can do a less of this. Open the blinds. You never know, you might enjoy the view. Grew up north. I don't believe it. Why not try these instead of these? On your project, why don't you try and slow one of these? A bird box, or maybe one of these, a bat box. Make sure we recycle everything we possibly can. In fact, why are we even making waste like this in the first place when we can reuse things? It's all about being resource efficient. Oh, and it counts at home as well, too. Why don't you make sure your site's got a super efficient dehumidifier in the drying room? Oh, and by the way, you're going to have to shut the door. Do you really need to be carrying this much stuff around with you? Remember, less weight is better fuel efficiency. So whatever you do on the 5th of June, try doing it a little bit different. Try doing it this time with a planet in mind. For more information, visit unet.org.